Alright, I'm going to show you guys how to play your Nintendo 64, your Super Nintendo, or your Nintendo Entertainment System on your PC without emulators with the real deal. Alright? Alright, the very first thing you need to make sure is that you have an RF cable, well, not an RCA. RCA is a red, white, and yellow, and RF is a cable you hook up to your cable for a TV. The cable looks like this. This is connected to my PC tuner. So I get it from the cable from my PC. But the also, RF adapter has this nifty little thing in the back so you can plug your regular cable in so you can get TV also. Alright, now if you got that, if now that you got your Nintendo 64 connected to your video tuner, download Dscaler. Alright, okay, now that you got Dscaler download, I'm going to show you the options for it to use. Alright, go to Dshow, Video Input, make sure it's on Video Tuner, none of the rest will work. Then go to Channel, Setup, make sure it's on USA Cable Frequency, not like Australian Air Frequency, none of the rest will work, and it's there by default, so change it to USA Cable Frequency. And make sure it's on channel 3, 4, or 2, depending on which setting you got. Any of those will work. Alright, now to create your video, you go to Actions Recording. Then on the recording, there will be a menu, but it's cut off by my Hypercam. Okay, and then you go to Options. Then with Options, you go to that check box and make sure it's at full height. Not half height. Full height. Because at half height, it's going to be really small and you aren't even going to be able to see it. And it's there by default, so you got to change that to full, to full height. And those are basically all the settings. Alright, now this is the video quality. To make a video, you just go to, in Dscaler, go to Actions, Recording, then press Record. Alright, as you can see, the video quality is pretty good. It's better than most emulators and... Probably about as good as a capture card, I'd say. Um, I'm gonna be using this to be making videos. And um, well, this is my brother's account, but he said I can make some videos, so any of you Orion Entertainment 18 fans out there are curious. Um, once in a while, it will be like you'll get a little bit laggy. Only when it's recording, though. When you're not recording, it plays golden. But just a little bit laggy. It doesn't really affect your gameplay that much. I would highly recommend this program to use, and hopefully this video was helpful for you and you can actually use it to play your old games. And thanks for watching.